Uh, the meet was fun. It, I had a great time running all those events. It was really good to have somebody else doing it alongside me, Grant. And um, it was really entertaining to see just where we are, even though we were so loaded up and running so many events. It was just nice to see that, okay, we can still perform this way in all these events, even though we're still having to battle it all, all day. Um, I think going through all of it, what really helped was just listening to Coach Kev and listening to the plan that he had. I've done it. I've done that twice now, so this is the third time I'm doing it. And each time it was just, I have to listen to Coach Kev, otherwise there's no way I'd make it through. And so that's really what I did the whole meet. Uh, running the four was, I th I've always hated the four. I just did not like the four ever. And I think this year I finally got to a place where it's like, okay, well I'm gonna have to run it to get better in my 200, to get stronger in my 100. And so me finally accepting that was what allowed me to run the 46 indoor, and then now coming back and run another 46 outdoor. I listen to Coach Kevin, the game plan was just go out there and try to run a personal best in the prelims, just so that I can focus on the one and the two the following day. And that's exactly what I did. I think throughout the day, Coach Kevin, Coach Kevin told us we weren't running the four by four. He told Grant and I we weren't running it. And so that was out of our minds. And so we went out to every event, just kind of thinking, all right, new race, just running like it's the last one, focus on this one and not worry about what's to come. Um, once we finished the 200s, we kind of had a discussion and was like, well, we can either go at it here or we can save it for later, but there's no guarantee at other meets. And so Grant and I kind of decided, why not? We're already here, we're already sore, so we might as well go out there and try to put something out there. And I think it was, it was easier having the other guys as well who had run 47, who had run personal best in the four earlier to come together and put that, put that race together because it was by far one of the slowest splits I've had in any 4x4, but that's because I was so tired. But the time came out so well just because everybody else was running as well. So it really helped to have the support of the team as well. It was fun. It was, I felt, I, I didn't really think about it while I was competing, that it was going to be my last, like my last time here. But once they, they, the announcer started to say it, once I was receiving the most outstanding, outstanding athlete, it kind of came like hit me and it was like wow this is my last time and like i've had a fun run like it's been great i've accomplished a lot and i'm, I'm proud of myself honestly and proud of my team grateful to my coaches because honestly i wouldn't be able to do half of the things i did if it wasn't for my coaches and going forward past pac west i want to go into nationals and do something even more crazy out there so that's the goal